Know what you want and put it out into the universe so that you can manifest abundance in your life. What is it that you want? Think about who you want to become and what you want to become. Why? As ancient Guru said, when you think about that thing, you become that thing. If you aim to be wealthy, envision yourself in that prosperous state. Picture in your mind already having lots of money and a beautiful house. As you align with universal energy over time, you'll attract the wealth you've been thinking about. Many of you have heard of manifestation and the law of attraction are age-old concepts with origins as far back as Hindu scriptures and Buddhism. It's really about learning how to love yourself. You need to think of yourself as something that you desire to be, believe in yourself, and strive for more than you can ever imagine. It's all about the mindset you carry with you. In this video, I'll share a practical guide on how to communicate with the universe to manifest your desires into reality. It's not just another clickbait. Watch the entire video to discover the process and witness the magic unfold. We have the power to manifest abundance in our lives by focusing on our mind, body, soul and wealth. Trusting that what's out there for you is out there for you. What's meant for you is meant for you. The universal language is energy. In the vast expanse of the universe, every element carries its distinct energy and frequency. If you want to align yourself with the universe and manifest your desires, you need to understand that we communicate on a vibrational level. Regardless of your beliefs or practices, there's a commonality, the power of energy. You are part of this undeniable truth that energy, a force permeating everything, follows a fundamental rule. It cannot be created or destroyed, only transformed. This intricate dance of energy takes on profound significance when you consider its connection to the universe. Imagine the universe like a giant magnet and you are part of this cosmic connection. The energy you give off, whether you are aware of it or not, syncs up with the vast energy around you. If you ever feel low or sad, know that your energy acts like a magnet, pulling in more of the same. It's like a basic but powerful rule. What you put out into the universe comes back to you. Now, think about how powerful it is to radiate happiness and abundance. Regardless of what's happening around you, trusting that the universe is guiding you to a better life becomes a source of positivity. Your happy energy becomes like a magnet, attracting more positive vibes. It's a simple truth. What you feel, you attract. In the big picture of life, you have the power to shape your reality. Your conscious choice decides what kind of energy you bring into your life. Right now, in the middle of time and space, your thoughts and the energy you send out set the stage for your life in the next two to three years. This isn't just a big idea, it's a real thing for you. So, take a moment to figure out what you want. Your thoughts and energy are like the architects of your future. Start making things happen by purposely sending out the kind of energy that matches your dreams. Your journey to a happier and more abundant life starts with intentionally bringing in the energy you want. Now the real question is how do we ask for what we want? How do we talk to the guidance and higher self? Think about it like this. When you speak about something, you think about it, and when you think about it, you become it. Try this right now. Recall a happy memory. As you talk about it, you naturally feel that happiness. Or describe your favorite food, you can almost taste it, right? That's because speech creates a vibrational trigger. Sometimes, when you pray or ask for things, you might unintentionally focus on what you don't want. You could be saying, please, I don't want this anymore. And your vibrational frequency might be filled with hate, fear, anger and negativity. Consequently, the universe responds in alignment with those vibrations. This is why some individuals find success in their prayers, while others feel like their prayers go unanswered. To enhance your prayers and manifest your desires effectively, begin with gratitude. Take a moment to express appreciation for life, love, breath, and all that surrounds you. Thank you, 
universe and guides of the highest truth and compassion. I am ready to feel free. I welcome a newfound faith. Say this prayer out loud and take a moment to settle into the feelings. Think of gratitude as your direct line to the universe, connecting you with the positive forces at play. Once gratitude fills your thoughts, transition to your intentions. Clarify what you want for yourself and the world. Let's say you wanted a job promotion, but you were scared that this time someone else might get promoted. So, how do you manifest a job promotion? How do you release the energy that will attract you to what you desire? As ancient guru said, show gratitude as if you already got that promotion. Imagine that you got promoted, how would you feel? Excited and happy, you feel light, and you call your family and share the good news. You may throw a party and celebrate. Visualize doing that through your mind's eye. Direct your focus towards your desires rather than dwelling on fears. Envision yourself already possessing what you desire. Embrace the celebration as if it's unfolding in the present moment. The more you revel in and immerse yourself in these positive emotions, the higher your vibrational frequency becomes, paving the way for a quicker response from the universe. Don't think about someone else that might get promoted. You deserve that promotion, so you are the one who will be promoted. Just shift your mind to being promoted and celebrating it with your friends and family, and you won't believe the energy shift you will feel within seconds of your mind shift. This intentional shift sets the stage for a powerful and positive connection with the universe. But remember, through manifestation, isn't even about getting what we think we want. It's about receiving what is of the highest good for all. Don't get me wrong, but you will have experiences in which you will attract exactly what you want. But controlling outcomes to get just what you want isn't the goal. Remember, your plan isn't always the best. For example, if all your meditations and affirmations are around landing a promotion at work, you might completely block a way better opportunity at a different company. When you ask the universe for what you want, exciting things can happen. If you are looking for better opportunities somewhere else, believe that the universe will lead you to bigger and better things. Don't stress about controlling everything, just let go. Tell the universe what you want and let it bring you the best version of the reality you dream of. Embrace this process as you embark on a journey of manifestation. When you connect with the universe or the divine, try this personal method. First, say thanks for things in your life. Then say clearly what you want to set your intentions, clearly stating what you desire for yourself and your surroundings. Immerse yourself in the celebration of these desires, imagining them as already part of your reality. This celebratory mindset helps create a harmonious and swift pathway for your wishes to materialize. Think of it like putting together a plan that makes your thoughts and feelings match what you want. This journey of making things happen on purpose is about enjoying each step with a positive attitude. So, as you follow this path, really get into the idea that you can make things happen the way you want. It's like setting the stage for your dreams to come true. Thanks for tuning in. If you've gained insights from this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and ring the notification bell to stay updated on our fantastic content. We'd love to hear about your experiences with energy and mindset, so feel free to share in the comments below. Your engagement means a lot. God bless.